With this script-based action, we will show you how to quickly see the amount of RAM cache in use by a PVS-based VM. To get started, first download and install the SBA by opening the script-based actions management window and finding the script under the Community Actions tab. You can also search for the script in the search box on the right side of the window. Once you have found the script, click on the Add button on the right in order to add it to your organization's repository. Accept the terms and click Add Action. You will see the script downloading and installing. Once completed, the box changes to Installed. The script is now available to all Control-Up users in the organization. Let's go to the computer's view and choose some VMs we would like to review. Highlight them, right-click, go to Script-Based Actions, and choose our newly installed SBA from the list. The SBA runtime window pops up and it starts running the PowerShell script. While the script is running, we want you to know that the script will also detect PVS-based VMs that use hard drive cache only, as well as VMs that are configured for RAM cache that overflows to disk. If it does not use PVS at all, you will see that as well. And here are the results. The output line on the right side shows us the cache size, while the output window below shows all the data we retrieve during this SBA, which includes useful statistics about the cache file and the drive it's on.